Hey guys, what's up? So wow, it's literally only been a day or maybe it's been like two days since I made a video because I might fall asleep while editing this right after I, I right after I film it because I'm really tired. But anyway, one or two days, it doesn't matter because it's still quite early to make another video, at least for me. <laughs> So today I actually have my laptop instead of my iPad because my iPad's almost dead because I was binge watching Criminal Minds. Dad Matthew Good Googler because he's the only man to ever kill all men except Matthew Good Googler and Ben Chan. <laughs> anyway, um yeah, so my iPad's almost dead and so I'm gonna be watching MC and D's comeback. Uh, I forget how many nas they were. I think it was like, just na na na. I think. <laughs> um, and it's loading. Okay, I have to switch my accounts. And honestly, like I don't know what to expect because I they didn't really put much of the song in the teaser, right? So I don't know what to expect. I don't know what I'm going into. All I know is that this is like a completely different style from uh, Ice Age or spring so this should be interesting so without further ado let's get to it also yeah i do have my lamp there because the bulb uh burned out and i didn't want to just leave it on my bedside table so there, there's a lamp asos.com stop what you're doing there's 10 percent off everything I can't at escape asos these, right can now I? That... no i cannot i'm just gonna turn down real quick captions Oh, English captions, okay. Turn it up. All the people get ready. Are you not ready? Oh, oh my god. Oh, let's go win. Come on. Let's go, Heejun. Is that Minjay? God took his time making Minjay, I'm telling you. So good. They're all getting so much lines. Hey. God took his time on Minjay. Okay, I'm gonna pretend I didn't see that. Oh, I thought I was gonna. Uh, I thought the beat was gonna drop. They improved so much. Oh my god, I... Let's go, Minjin. Whoa. 
I actually know what I want to say, but let me just sit here and absorb all that hype. I feel like I just got even more tired just watching that. <laughs> okay, so first of all, wow. I knew that this would be very different from like Ice Age and um, um, Spring, but not that different. Um, <laughs> we love to see that broken YouTube, 18,225 views versus 30,000 likes. We love to see that broken YouTube. <laughs> Um, anyway, yeah, so that was very unexpected, like, even with the teasers they gave us, I was not expecting that at all, and I feel like I kept trying to be, like, I kept trying to hype up each individual member, but I really couldn't because they kept getting, like, lines, which I was, which I realized is such a good thing, because usually it's just a certain member, at least for, like, MC and D style, or the way that the producer, or the songwriters write the song or <sighs> ignore what I'm saying uh, the way that the company like divides up the lines because usually it's the company that does that usually for MCND like you would notice that there's like longer raps and then because like in spring there's uh, Win and then Songjun I realize I have not said a stage name once so if you guys don't know who Songjun is that is Castle Jin Castle J, I hate that stage name. He's my bias, but I hate it so much. I hate that stage name. Mm, I'm sorry, Song Jin, I just don't like it. Anyway, like in spring, before the first chorus hits, it's Win and Song Jin's verse. And then it's immediately, da da da, I can't sing, da 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 da, that one, the chorus. And they have quite a lot of like rap before, or quite a lot of time before, um, the actual chorus hits but for this for not for, it is three knots na 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 for na 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 i feel like it's very um they, they divided it up a lot into a lot into a lot of the smaller sections and so i was trying to like hype up each of the individual members and i was like failing because it kept switching so quickly i was like Ugh. <laughs> like i know all the members there's only like five of them so i know all of them but this everything was going so quickly i was like oh whoa this definitely gives me icon vibes, um, like uh, early icon, obviously. Um, but I will say that even though they did switch the genre of song very much so, even from how hype Ice Age was, this is another level of hype. Um, they they are still MCND, like it's still like got that boyish kind of childish energy to it, and I love that so much. Where where um nom, nom, Song Jun was wearing those glasses glasses and I was like the frick I might just put a screenshot if I can go back and find it I'll put it right here <laughs> I don't know whose idea that was to put him in those but it happened there's no going back um let's see oh my god I feel like also they really improved they they improved so much each comeback I'm like shocked with each comeback. Like all like Minjay was just singing and all of a sudden he just um hit that like random high note. I was like, whoa. Um I also feel like Heejun improved a lot. Like I feel like his falsetto or just or higher tone in general is just a lot better. I feel like in spring I feel like it was a little I don't know. I don't know. I feel like it just comes it sounds like it comes a lot more naturally now to him or to them, to both Heejun and Minjay, the higher notes. So someone commented MCND stylist. So what look are y'all going for? MCND. Yes. <laughs> I'm gonna like that comment. That's good. That's funny. Okay. And then someone put their yes. <laughs> someone put their yes style um code. Oh my god, I stand that. Oh my gosh, that was so good though. We stand that. Oh my gosh, we love a group that can do all concepts. We stand that. And for whatever reason, I keep thinking Songjun is my age or younger because he has a very young look about him. He gives off like very youthful energy. He's like a oh an old one liner, so he's a year older than me. I'm gonna look that up. Ugh. He's a 99 liner. He looks like he's my age. I want to age like that. What? Um. Okay, May 31st, so he's 
He's about almost exactly three years older than me. What? I want to age like that? What the heck? Okay, also I want to know, did he produce or... Yeah, did he produce and write this again? I would like to know, it doesn't say. <laughs> I'm gonna look that up too. Who produced this? It do be not saying though. It do be not saying though. <laughs> I mean, I could just look it up on Spotify because usually Spotify has the credits and who wrote the stuff, but I don't know if it's gonna be up there immediately for a group like MC and D. Which kind of makes me say, yeah, the profile picture is still the one from spring, so I'm not expect. yeah, I wasn't expected to see it. Oh, I'm kind of bummed out. I want to know. I feel like over these past couple of reaction videos, I've been really curious about who's producing the songs I react to, just because they're, they've all been so unique. First of all, there was Boca with that kind of almost Spanish rock flair. Of course, it's Boca. It's a the language, yes. And then, there, and then there was To Be or Not To Be with that kind of like swiftly changing genre and then there's this. I still haven't found, found I still haven't, yeah I still haven't found out who uh, produced uh, To Be or Not To Be. So I'm gonna look it up. Oh, it's all RBW producers. So the person who produced Eternally shouldn't be in there unless they work for both companies, which would probably not be so because there, otherwise, there wouldn't be an RBW next to that. That's who eternally takes team. Yeah, that was that's not even a, a Korean producer for who produced eternally. Anyway, now I have discovered that, um, and I lost the bet that I made in the last video. Uh, good thing I didn't bet money because I would have lost money just then. Anyway, back to talking about the video I actually reacted to. Oh my gosh, that was so good. I'm just not over how much they improved. Like not only did the kind of the 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 I forgot the word. Not only did the, like the organization or like the the way that they split up the song. Not only did did that change, but they also improved to match. And I'm like, yes. I feel like sometimes, unpopular opinion. Sometimes rookie groups will. Oh, what the fuck was that? <laughs> I'm not a scary cat. Anyway, I sometimes I feel like rookie groups will like not not improve a lot throughout their comebacks or throughout their consecutive comebacks but then eventually you see like this huge improvement i feel like mc and d is improving like with each comeback and i think that's pretty spectacular so if you guys aren't standing mc and d you should keep an eye keep an eye out for them now because they just did that okay choreography wise oh my god it looks so fun but it also looks so tiring jeez um i i'm gonna give this a 10 out of 10, mostly because the way that the filmmaking was, is they, they, I'm just gonna watch a little bit of it in the court, during the course. They varied it with a lot of wide shots, with a lot of close-up shots, and then not, not to mention the lights going off in the background with the fire, and then just the background, um, visuals. I was like, ooh, so it's kind of hard for me, in terms of just music video production, it was kind of hard for me to focus on the choreography, but I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna... I'm not gonna like judge it because of the other surrounding aspects of it. So from what I saw, I'm gonna give that a 10 out of 10, choreography wise. Song wise, it's because they changed the way that they organized the song, that, I forget the name of that, or forget the word for that. The way that, because they changed the way, the line distribution, I guess, because they changed that, I kind of don't know how to feel about it yet. My favorite is still, um, a tie between spring and ice age because who can choose between those two um but nevertheless this is still like freaking good so i'm gonna give it like a 9.8 out of 10 because i don't i don't like know how to feel about it yet but give me a little bit and i'll be just like vibing out to it every single day like how i was to spring and ice age every single day when i wake up you would just hear na 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 to ice age every single day, every single morning, yet, without fail, huh? Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. As I always say in literally every video, if you want to talk about MC and D, about na na na, about your bias, about your bias record, about the music video, about the new, the new way, the, the new way that they're writing this, or they're making the songs, 
feel free to comment and I would love to reply and hopefully other people reply and we have conversations. Also, as always, if you like this video, feel free to give it a thumbs up, subscribe, and hit that notification bell because I will be doing an unboxing of my 17 karat album very soon because apparently it's on the island and it's at that stage where it's gonna be about to be put into transit. So I should get it tomorrow, if not the day after tomorrow. So I'm gonna try to do an unboxing video and we'll see how that goes because I don't have the proper equipment to do an unboxing video. But you'd, we'll just see it be done in, in in my special way to do unboxings, I guess. Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. Bye.